Dysomancer. I don't know too much about this game. I just saw a screenshot of the gameplay and it looked cool. I'm not sure if I need to do the prologue. I guess yes. <laughs> I guess, yep. That's what we're doing. What a great day. Let's go fishing on the west side of the village. Hmm. Ordinary wolf. This is the mana cost. This is your mana pool. I have three mana right now. Uh, limit is four. Go over and the first... Ah, okay, so if I get more mana than four, it just disappears. End of the turn, click that. Well, I think I can manage. Deal three damage to the wolf. Aww. Gain three block. <laughs> cool. Enemy's intentions. Got it. Mm-hmm. So he's gonna do me three damage in total. Wait, did he do that? No. Oh, he didn't do his, his thing yet. Okay. Um, so do I still have my shield? I do. When you take damage, block is used first. Block halves each turn's start. Ah. Okay. Got it. It's pretty simple. Okay, we'll take some damage. <laughs> the music is so cute, but we're fighting a freaking big ass wolf. Choose between one new card. <laughs> Choose between one new card. Okay, let's take this one. <laughs> okay. Uh, uh, uh. Oh, what a cutie. He's gonna do a belly strike. I can heal. Watch out. The Spiky has a special ability, thick skin. Um. Oh! Regular strike cards can't harm it. Try using a more powerful card against it. Oh shit, a crossbow. Oh, this card is effective but requires water to use. Comes from any blue card. Huh? Drag the card to the mana pool. To exchange it for mana. Oh! Here both strike and one time crossbow can be exchanged. Oh! Where do I drag it then? There? Yeah. Oink. I'm sorry. Uh, I don't have energy anymore. Well, can I... Do I get... No. No, I can't do anything here because my because I have no more energy. Um. So do that. Oh, we still have one health, huh? He's very cute. Petting? Yeah, I would like to pet him. Nice. Another heal card. Strange girl. I met a girl. Swords and shield are so boring. Let's try these goodies. Okay. Get two times... Get Chaos Strike and a bunch of other stuff. Okay. Oh. 
The girl left? What the hell is all this? I know, I love it. A little snorty snorty. Multicolor mana cost. Ah, you can use two types of manas for this if you want to. If you have the swirly thing and the thingy thing mm, is saved first using colored mana first. Oh, okay. I understand. He's gonna do a belly pat! Oh, can you do a belly pat with me? That sounds so cute. Can I do it with you? Even better, actually. Um... Gain four luck. When rolling dice, roll an extra dice and take the highest result. Then lose one luck for every six luck. Roll more extra dice. Okay, that sounds... Sounds like it makes a lot of sense. Make, make this into mana, please. Yeah. Okay. I don't know. I rolled a four, I think. I'm not sure. Uh, let's... game block wait I can play this for free heals we also oh. we also draw two cards can I okay okay he did the belly pad mm. this guy's gonna be hard to kill Check 10, deal 8 damage, failed, gain 6 block. Roll a d20. If the result equals or is greater than the check value, so it's 8. But do we need the swirly mana for it and I don't have that? Do I get that if I... Yes. We need 8. Oh yo, easy. 18. Um, don't have enough mana. It needs both of those. Oh. So let's turn you into mana and then we can use this one. Oh shit, we did 19 damage. Okay. Well, this is pretty simple. The Fist of Pigkin. Pig King. The fuck? Why is this piggy so strong? Ah, oh, he's a boss, dude. He won't be able to handle it like this. Here's something for you. You can use this dice to change any number you see on the screen. The change is permanent until you die. <laughs> Try playing with this deck. <laughs> Ayo, hey, what the fuck? Deal 99 damage to all enemies? Deal 99 damage to yourself? What? Hold up. Permanently change the target number to whatever. Ah. So if I roll this. Oh! Yes. The max health. Nine. Again. What? Three? Wait. I can do it again. He's gonna do... Two damage. Instead of whatever he said he was gonna do. Uh Um I can change my health but 
Oh, that might screw me over. Yeah, this, this, this one, this one. I want to change the number of damage that this, this card will do to me. How do I do that? That. Two. This card will now do two damage to me instead of 99. Goodbye, pigkin. Oh wait, he still has this, whatever that is. It has to go lower. Okay, and turn. Interesting! <laughs> what a weird mechanic. Special grenade. But how do I... Don't do 12 damage. 5 is better. Um, I don't understand how to kill him though. Deal 99 damage to all your enemies. It's not doing that though, is it? It did nothing to him. Reduce damage taken by 99. Oh, I have to up that. I have to up the number. To above 99. Um... Oh, pff. More. Ah! Why do we throw a d6? Hold up. Okay. Oh, fuck. I should... Oh, okay. Well, we're dead. <laughs> okay. Okay, but I think I understand... I think I understand... What we're doing. So, can I now do the main uh, thing? <laughs> That's an interesting thing. Welcome to my home. This is the middle realm, the junction between parallel worlds. The world we just left is no more, but I can take you to countless almost identical worlds. However, no matter where you go, you'll have a purple mist chasing after you. If you can run all the way to the center of the royal city, I'll send you a to a world where you'll have time to leisure. Leisurely fish. Oh. Good luck. <laughs> Don't forget to bring the dice or you won't last an hour. Oh yeah, the one who gave me the dice, that's true. Upgrade? Orb of Emotion. You can use red orbs when selecting the start deck. Uh, okay. Mm -hmm. Prepare. Your class and your start deck will be generated based on the mana orbs you've chosen. You will gradually unlock the other orbs along the journey. For now, drag and drop the mana thing onto the center. Mm-hmm. Sage. Okay. After deciding your class, you will receive some start relics. Relics are very useful. Be sure to check it. Activated relics such as the one dice need a click to trigger its effect. Remember to use them. How do I do, do that though? I don't think that's something I need to do now, but... Might have misunderstood. Ah, the familiar scenery. Let's go a bit further and see. Oh, fuck. Jesus. Um, alright. Time passes. A little, little, little cute bird. The bird will increase its attack time each turn, but there is a limit. Strike, peck, peck. 
Um, so does this do regular damage? It does. Okay. Uh, I guess I'll block. Hey, chill. Um, let's sell this card for mana and kill the fucker. <laughs> Oops. Deal 10 damage, Miracle deal 12 damage. Miracle, if this card isn't drawn at this turn's draw phase, trigger it when it's... Trigger its effect when casting. Hmm. Discover a blue card, three. Exert. Pick a card from three cards that fits the requirement. Discover a card from another realm. Oh, cool. Question mark? It's probably a boss or something. A dedicated blacksmith. Passed by a blacksmith today. The old smithy was all sweaty, pounding iron intensely. He was so absorbed, mumbling, I've got to create the world's thinnest sword blade. Let me help out too? Check 12, fail, lose 3 health? Yeah, let me help you. Fuck. <laughs> Keep trying. Keep trying. Hey yo! Keep trying. Good. So I lost a bunch of health, I think. What a great sword. Get Mono Sword? Target enemy loses 9 health. Apply 9 bleed. Oh, yes, please. Cool. What's that? So shop. Why not buy something? I have 5 coins. Apply Butter Hand. When attacking, check 16. If it fails, damage is halved. Okay, but is it still good though? Whoa, this cost five mana, but four is the max, so that's interesting. <sighs> After casting, reduce one remain. Don't know what that is yet. Okay, butter hand. Let's do it. Sounds fantastic. At your draw phase end, discard one card from your hand. The bird's gonna take a card from me. If the enemy's health bar is broken, all of its focus intentions will be destroyed. If by time intention will remain inactive, it will uh, until trigger certain condition. Okay, well, my brain is not- doesn't wanna- doesn't wanna think about that too much right now. Um, after your s turn starts, you gain a random intention which will discard your card. Okay. Gain block. Oh yeah. Lock. Um. Gain 12 block, heal 7 health, deal 4 damage to the enemy, repeat 4 times. Yes. Wait, this costs a different kind of mana that I don't have.
Reload, keep in hand when the turn ends. I don't know, I don't know how it works. Hey! <laughs> yeah, I don't have that thing, okay. D4, okay. Hey, hey, of course that doesn't work. Hey, I thought I could make mana with this. Not if you don't have any energy left. <laughs> So I gave them butter hands, so they need to check 16, and if they don't, their damage is halved. Oh, that's cool. Let's see if it says an estimate. Yeah, <laughs> we'll kill them. Nice! Okay. Well, I've seen enough of this demo, we're moving on. I like it though. Very cool. Kind of Slay the Spire. But different. Yeah, it's good. <laughs>